Family Office Club, the number one ultra-wealthy investor club. At other events, 99% of the attendees are raising capital and seeking co-investors. At our events, we have real investors ready to allocate capital and invest in various deals. But first, don't just take our word for it. Allow our success stories to speak for themselves. We weren't here an hour, and then I met a gentleman who wants to put money into my fund at the tune of about $5 million. We have had multiple deals here from Richard and in the family office currently in the throes of step five and six of 10 of probably 10 deals with people I've met here. We have uh, new clients that have come to our firm uh, after meeting us at family office events. Uh, one, one that's funded and one that's in the process of funding. Had a wonderful uh, experience. We were able to close the deal there and we did new construction. So from that, we said, let's bring a bigger team. It's because of Family Office Club that my personal deal flow has gone up to 300 private placements per year. And that has really changed the life of my family. Now, let's delve into specific investor mandates by sector real estate and multifamily investments. My partner and I invest in value-add multifamily and covered land play deals in Seattle, Washington. We have about 10 million that we're looking to place here in the next 30 days. We invest in commercial real estate. Looking for opportunities on the real estate and private equity side. I'm here, I'm representing the family offices from Vietnam and um, a lot of majority in real estate uh, development projects allo um, and allocation capital into uh, multi-family units. Private equity and alternatives. We like investments such as private equity. Um, we like secondaries. We also like single deals such as real estate. Mainly, we've invested in equities. My A little bit of a uh, angel investing in multiple companies, which we've done very well with. So in our family office, we invest across private equity, real estate, venture capital, and hedge funds. Uh, we do mainly alternatives, about $2 billion. And so, um, yeah, I'm here to uh, talk to a lot of the members and um, look to collaborate. The venture capital uh, in the tech space, uh, SaaS space, uh, some growth stage private equity uh, in, in, in uh, companies that are leveraging technology to deliver, uh, you know, scale and, and uh, things in growing industries. Um, private uh, credit, private debt uh, is definitely an area of interest of, of mine. Specialized in emerging investments. I've placed a couple of deals into oil and gas. I've done private equity. I've done um, what they call freshwater marinas. They call it aquatic real estate. Uh, which is a new and emerging asset class. Uh, we're taking startups from all over the, the country and Israel and Europe, so we're very, very international. So anyone who has anything in wound care, wound care, business, PT, nursing home, would love to talk to you. Skilled nursing, would love to talk to you. I have a lot of interest in um, rolling up RIAs. So if you are looking to exit an RIA, I'm super interested in that. We look for deals in sports, media, and entertainment where we can be strategic. My family office really invests in a wide variety of operating businesses from around the world, anywhere, but it's all hardware, no software. So tangible technology, what I mean is hard medical devices. Operating businesses. Let's invest our own money in private early stage Life science company, which means uh, drugs, uh, diagnostics, digital health, and devices. I invest in early stage startups, typically SaaS and consumer marketplaces. I generally invest at seed stage. These companies are a year or two old. Maybe they have two to five hundred thousand a year in revenue. Our current asset allocation is about eighty percent public securities through an ESG screen that rings out private prisons. Uh, weapons manufacturers, oil and gas. We tend to focus on early stage, post-product, post-revenue, um, SaaS, tech-based opportunities. Um, I always call them Silicon Valley style of deals, if you will, so we're not looking at a ton of real estate, we're not looking at a ton of alternative investments. We tend to look for fintech, marketing technology, things of that nature. Are you looking to scale fast, connect with more investors, and tap into the perpetual learning machine of our investor club? Join our investor club to meet more investors in the next 30 days than most people can in three, six, or even 12 months. Also, access strategies on how to raise $10 million to $100 million in capital annually. Insights from a billion dollar plus wealth advisors, recordings of past events, and the number one collection of investment mandates. You will also gain business scaling strategies directly from centimillionaires, billionaires, and professional athletes speaking at our community events while simultaneously networking with them. Our investor portal boosts your deal's visibility by giving you access to specific videos that explain in detail what types of investment opportunities the investors in our club are seeking, making networking and meeting investors more efficient than doing it the old-fashioned way of scrubbing platforms like LinkedIn and wasting time at local networking events. In addition to the speakers, they have 
the networking and the opportunity to meet people and exchange information and trade knowledge is just incredible. If you're in the business of investing, you need to be at the Family Office Club because this is where all the action is. I'm, I'm blown away by the attendees and what I've seen and what I've heard. Uh, it, it was, it, I, I don't think I've ever, I, I'm nearly 80 years old, I've never seen anything quite this good. Connect with us today and learn how to connect with our 7,500 person investor community that has provided results for over 17 years to firms seeking capital. Visit familyoffices.com.